Whatever picture you hold in your mind, the brain translates that into complementary chemistry. If I have a picture of love, my brain releases wonderful things into the blood like dopamine for pleasure, oxytocin to bond with others, a growth hormone. And growth hormone does exactly what it says. So when you're in love, you're releasing this growth hormone which enhances your vitality. And that's why when people fall in love, they get so healthy, they get, you know, they say, oh, look how they glow, they're so in love. And I go, this is the chemistry of the blood engaging the behavior of the cells. But I say, well, but what if I'm holding a picture of something that scares me? I say, well, you're not gonna release love chemistry, you start to release stress hormones and factors that affect the immune system and all that. And I said, well, that's a different chemistry. I go, yeah, just like in the culture dish, a different chemistry leads to a different genetic activity. If I want to change my genetics, do I have to go in and change the cells? And I said, no, it's changing your thought. That's all you have to do.